Hi guys, welcome back to P of Sedoli. Today we're going to be starting Outdoor and Adventurous Activities, a new unit. Well done to all those of you who have already uploaded your HIT workout. Those of you who haven't, please do so. You've got to the end of the week. If not, we will be writing to your parents again. Okay, what are Outdoor and Adventurous Activities, I hear you ask? Well, I'd like to think back to previous years where we've used a compass, and where we've walked around the school looking at different things. We're going to take that step further. So, in today's short video, we're going to be talking about cardinal points. We're going to be talking about how to work out uh, which direction we can be going look, using the sun. Obviously, never look directly at the sun, but using the sun. And we'll also be looking at keys on maps. Okay, so the key isn't to unlock the map. Okay. It's to give you an idea of, for example, if you see a tree, you know it's a tree. But sometimes it's not quite as easy. So a blue line could be a river and so on. By the end of this unit, what would you have needed to have done? You would needed to have devised your own map, giving us your cardinal points and directions now to reach somewhere. So a bit like a treasure map. Okay, We'll need to know what the cardinal points are and why we use them. OK, and we will also need to fill in some questions on Google Forms. OK, so at the end of every lesson, what you'll see on your Google Classroom is the link to a video or the link to a document or a Google Form. So at the end of every lesson, I would like you just to fill in a quick Google Form, usually no more than five questions. OK, so that I can see that you've actually understood the lesson and there will also be a section where you can add comments of things you haven't understood so we can explain them. Okay, so today we'll be looking at cardinal points. They are north, east, south and west. We'll also be looking at our key, so how to make a key. Okay, and obviously once we've finished this, if you've still got time to do some activity, go for it. I'm really happy that lots of parents have replied to me that you, you guys are doing lots of exercise before we were allowed out, but now we're allowed out even better, okay? I know we're all enjoying going out and getting some fresh air, but be careful, okay? You need to do it little by little. Our bodies have been inactive, and now we need to gradually build them back up, okay? So, that's it for today, and I hope you have a great lesson, and I'll see you again on Thursday. Virtual high five, virtual fist bump. See you in the next one. So guys, as you can see, this is a map key. Okay, we can see land, water, mountain, and so on. You need to start getting familiar with these because you will need to do it in one of your maps when we'll carry on uh, doing them later on. Okay. These are the cardinal points. North, east, south, and west. However, now you're in year five, we've added northeast, southeast, southwest, and northwest. Okay, so you'll need to use these to, to give directions. So, how do we know which direction we're going if we do not have a compass? Well, here's a clue. If we look at the sun, obviously not directly at the sun, but if we look where the sun is... And it is before midday, so before we have had our lunch, then the sun is in the east. If it is after we've had our lunch and the sun is on our right, that is the west. OK, so wherever the sun is before midday is east, where it is after midday is west and from there we can work out which direction we're going by working through our north east south west remember naughty elephants squirt water okay take care see you next week goodbye